need computer training for a group or office, contact us today to get a free demo of our training at www.teachucomp.com forward slash enterprise dash licensing. After you have made any change to a document that you want to keep, you should save the document. Learning to save your work frequently is one of the most important computer skills you can have. When you save a document for the first time, you must use the Save As dialog box. To open this dialog box, click the File tab within the ribbon, and then click the Save As command. This will open up the Save As dialog box. In the Save As dialog box, you need to give Word both a location where the document will be saved and a file name. Give it a name that you will remember, and be sure to remember where you saved it. File names may be up to 255 characters in length, but should probably be short and descriptive. Word will not let you use the following symbols in a file name. The colon, the forward slash, the backslash, the greater than or less than signs, the asterisks, double quotes, or the pipe. When you are ready to save the document, click the Save button in the lower right corner of the Save As dialog box. Once you have named and saved the file, its name will appear in the document's title bar. When you save your changes in the future, you will not have to re-enter the name and location. To save changes to a document you have saved once before, you can either click the File tab in the ribbon and then click the Save command, or you can click the Save button in the Quick Access toolbar to let Word automatically save the changes to the document to the same place with the same name. Like what you see? Get a free demo of our training for groups of five or more at www.teachucomp.com forward slash enterprise dash licensing.